Hello wonderful little beans, my name is Bee and welcome back to my channel. Before we get started with today's video, don't forget to leave a like, subscribe and click that bell and of course you stack a B when buying Robux or Premium. I just want to say you guys, I am feeling like I'm getting my merger back of how I used to be when I made videos on YouTube years ago. Because there's so much to talk about for Royal High right now, it's actually giving me some hype because while I do enjoy the fact that we've been mostly live streaming different games other than Royal High, I have actually been enjoying recording Royal High again so I hope you don't mind that for the last couple of weeks my videos have been pretty much just Royal High. I am enjoying myself plus because Royal High videos are quite easy to make it's meant that I've had more time for streaming and more time for spending time with family and friends and honestly it's been a really nice experience so I am grateful to all of you who have taken the time to just vibe with me through these Royal High videos. Anyways little beans today we are going to be talking about the new update that just came out on Friday. I know I'm a few days late but as you guys know I already had videos recorded and I was streaming a lot because for those who don't know we just did a front page live stream on Twitch in front of a lot of people across the world. We had like two and a half thousand people watching where we celebrated LGBTQ plus awareness specifically trans visibility and just had a really lovely time with you guys so thank you so much to everyone who came out to that stream. If you haven't already followed me on my Twitch I do encourage you to do so the link is down below the next stream is tomorrow tuesday at 3 p.m eastern then we're streaming again on thursday at 3 p.m eastern and don't forget this saturday at 1 p.m eastern is our next giant pageant the first one we've had for ages we do have a prize of a halo and 100k diamonds for first place and some prizes for second and third so make sure you come by to my twitch to participate again the link is below if you want to follow but if you don't have an account you can just download the twitch app or go to the twitch.tv website and type in my name anytime you like or click on my stream link anytime you like as long as i'm live you'll be able to see it without an account anyway so as you guys know a new update came out on friday it was a new hair update because royal high has started of course their regular hair release system so for those who don't know new hairs are basically coming out every single week First of all, we had the masculine ones that came out the week before, and I haven't actually talked about these yet. We did get three new masculine ones, swept middle part, styled windswept hair, and movie star middle part. Now these are all only mildly different. For the most part, the hairs are quite similar. The bangs are the main part that's different. The part at the front is just slightly different to the rest. As you can see, the shape just slightly changes, but for the most part, it is mostly the same. Now, some people have been a little bit upset about the fact that this hair has been mostly the same. People are said that Royal High haven't been adding more drastically different hairs but I'm hoping that they're ramping up to adding some more newer ones that are a bit more drastically different. Now in terms of the feminine styles the new ones that we got I believe are these three at the top so we've got three new feminine ones I think assuming I'm not wrong actually Flower Girl might have been out already the week before and these two might be just the new ones. I think Flower Girl and Flower Queen we already had because they were flowery versions of two hairs we've already had but either way I know for sure that these these two here are brand new. So we have Spring Evening and Spring Soiree. Now a lot of people pointed out that Spring Soiree is kind of an interesting word for it because Soiree is evening in another language, I believe in French, somebody said on Twitter. Now I don't know how accurate that is. I was just reading something that somebody said on Twitter and obviously that doesn't mean it's necessarily 100% correct. But when I was reading it, that's what they said. So it is interesting to think that maybe they have just taken the same name and they are just slightly adjusted hairs. You can tell that this one is like, two turn obviously you can change the clovers the roses and the and the leaves and then obviously you can set a different color it has a different like flower in the hair and then it has like two turn color as you can see this one is only a little bit different pulled in a little bit more and is more of a solid color choice but obviously it all depends on the color and accessory that you put on it anyways depending on how you decide to color that accessory depending on how you decide to put the textures on your hair etc will change how this all looks and works so obviously little beans it's not the most different than what we are used to obviously we are used to much more drastic differences than that one but it's definitely different I mean the difference is definitely there they are new hairs even if they're not drastically new they are different so obviously I don't know what you guys are thinking about these hairs but I am a little bit I don't know. I don't know how to feel. It's an interesting update, you guys. Some people are disappointed because they don't think the hairs are drastically different enough. Other people are happy that we're getting consistent hairs and that each one is a little bit different. So it does give you those different options if you want them. I'm not really sure where I stand right now because it does feel like the differences maybe just aren't quite big enough and hopefully we are going to get some more unique ones. I am hoping that they are still working on hiring some new developers. There was conversation, obviously, that they were potentially hiring some new ones. So far, oh no. So far, 
that every single hair that's come out has been from the same set of developers. I do think it would be nice to see some new people potentially have the opportunity to put some hairs into the game. Hopefully that is in the works. As you guys know, I'm not sure exactly whether or not Kitzilla has any control over the hairs or anything, but we do know that obviously she has been on break since she had a baby. So there is always a chance that maybe those things will pick back up once she's back. I'm not sure. We'll have to wait and see. But for now, I am looking forward to maybe seeing some things that are just a little bit more unique. I think that would be nice, especially if they hire developers in the community who already know how to do this, give more people a chance to participate in contributing for their favorite game and also be able to have more drastic differences, especially as we get closer and closer to more releases for Campus 3 and obviously the release of Campus 4. I'm really hoping we do get something new in the game soon though, like some part of the Campus 3 unlocked or at least Campus 4 soon because the game is certainly starting to feel a bit stale and I think you guys can tell based on the amount of people playing that people are getting a lot more impatient and are starting to feel like what's the point in playing if the developers aren't actively giving us much especially because we haven't really seen much communication outside of those streams recently and obviously we can see the progress on streams but they don't save that progress after the streams are done and then share it on their social medias I think that's something that they should do to help sort of encourage the community to know that they are listening and working on things and continue that communication I do think the developers live streaming their progress is really good it's a good callback to 2020 when they used to do that and a lot of the community has been really happy about it but I do think there still needs to be more steps forward so that'll be let me know in the comments down below what you think about these new hairs are you satisfied with them or not I think a new halo is supposed to be on the way soon because obviously the story contest has been completed and a new badge was created but the halo hasn't yet been released so I'm not entirely sure what they're doing with that but hopefully there is going to be one soon all right little beans thank you so much for watching i hope you have a wonderful day i'll see you all soon and remember to stay happy stay positive remember to love the people around you and never let anybody else dim your light you are wonderful wonderful people i love you guys lots and i'll see you soon goodbye